it's been way too long since I unbagged some heat for you guys, but don't worry, I got you. What it do YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of Daily Swag with your girl Lady Swag. Today I'm going to be doing an unbagging from Reason Clothing. Now if you guys haven't caught my first two unbaggings, because this is unbagging number three, here are the videos right here. You can check the description for the links below and it'll give you the full videos to my Reason Unbagging number one and Reason Unbagging number two. But I'm not going to do a whole lot of talking, I'm just going to jump straight into unbagging what we have here. So let's go, let's see what we got. And the one item that I was looking forward to the most is right on top, so Good, we're gonna start with that. All right. All right, so the first thing we're gonna start with is, of course, a blue jean jacket. As you guys know, a nice blue jean jacket is always my weakness. This jacket, I'm already excited because it looks better in person than what I thought it was going to be. So, off top. <laughs> Yo, this far. I like that. All right, well, let's, let's flip it around. So, the brand for this is uh, Mason Noor. If I'm saying that wrong, my apologies. But that's the way that it looks, Mason Noor. So, on the front, what I like, it had a lot of uh, smiley faces. So, we're just going to go straight down the jacket. So, we'll start with the right side. So, on the right side... As you can see, you've got a lot of stitching between the distressed blue jean here. And I'm not sure if you can see the stitching here, but all this right here, this is stitching. And then up here through the distressed blue jean look, you've got like some, some hot pink stitching going on. Um, also, some stitching on the pockets as well. So really, really nice. Oh, uh, let's see. So we do have some white. Looks like where they uh, may have airbrushed the buttons here. So just some white on the buttons right there. Um, they did miss some spaces, but I don't think anybody is gonna be all in my face today. We're like, oh, yo, your buttons ain't spray painted all the way. I don't think nobody gonna do all that. So um, I like that. This has that sticky material that Reason Clothing loves to put on t-shirts, which I hate, but their shirts are always so fire looking. I buy them anyway, I can't help it. But I have to say it doesn't feel as bad on the, the blue jean jacket here. It actually works really well. Now, I, uh, going down the jacket, I see we not only have white buttons, we got some pink. So it looks like they have one random pink button and the rest are white. Not sure why they did the one random pink, but it coordinates with the pink that they have here in the stitching, so I'm good with it. Um, speaking of that stitching, heading on down the right side, we've got the smiley face right here. Additional stitching, try to bring it up closer so you guys can get a better look at it. So this is like a material that they sewn in. And I love how they kept the edges distressed around the stitching of the smiley face. Now, flipping over to the left side of the jacket. Got more like your little spray paint type look smiley face. And looks like they painted pink right here. And then I love the, the Mason Noir that they have right here in the different colors. And got some of that blue coming down at the bottom. This is just... A very well executed jacket like I love it I'm um, heading up top because I didn't even see this we've got some paint with the white polka dots some more distressed blue jean here as you can see you can kind of pull that out a little bit to expose some darker jean under it and they've got the distressed look going there along with some more stitching right there as well all right let's un unbutton it so we can take a look at the label that's in the back of the jacket All right, so it just has Mason Noor on a tag. I'm a medium, so it is a size medium. I believe they have these running from a size small all the way to double XL. Again, that website is reasonclothing.com, so you can check out the website there as well. And then it's, it's got the tag Mason Noor, top quality garments. All right, flipping around to the back. So much sauce. We'll just start with the center. So. Center of the jacket, 
Um, it's better than what I thought because online this looked like it had just been painted onto the jacket, but it's actually embroidered. So you've got your patch here, your smiley face patch. As you can see it's cloth and it's embroidered. As you can see they got the painting on the back. Smiley face got a little pink drip. They got the little blue, the pink. We got some palm trees popping. We got a little bit of the black polka dots on the back. That stitching that we had all over the front, we got it going on on the back too. It's black stitching um, over, looks like they kind of had where they may have, I don't know how they achieved this look actually, let's not pretend. But um, <laughs> this is not all stitching, it's like a darker blue jean that's under here. So it's blending in quite well with the black. Really like the way that they did that. Uh, what else we got here? Again, it was the smiley faces that made me buy the jacket. So we got a smiley face on the left sleeve of the jacket with some more stitching, with some more polka dots going on. It's really nice. Flipping over to the right side of the jacket. Let's see what we got here. Okay, we got a peace symbol, a couple of palm trees, some more of the, the polka dotting going on. So yeah, very, very pleased with this jacket. Matter of fact, let me just, let's see how it fits. So I can give you guys feedback on sizing. All right, fits decently. I have a medium. I think the medium looks okay. It might be a little, it's a little big in the sleeves, I'll say that. So I don't think I would have sized down though because then I would have been trying to pop out the chest if I want to button it up here. I usually don't button up my um my blue jean jackets. I just kind of leave them open, let them do their thing. But overall, move my lock so y'all can get a real good look on what the, the back looks like. But yeah, this is a medium. Um, all these things are in men's sizing. So yeah, I like the jacket. It's saucy to me. It's a it's a good look for summertime. If you're just going in somewhere where maybe let's say you're going into like a restaurant and it's cooler on the inside and you just want a nice, you know, popping summertime type jacket to throw on, you can throw on this. But I think it would be cool for winter to give you a few pops of color here and there as well. All right, so that's the jacket. What else we got in here? All right. So they got some pants now. These I'm gonna call my dream pants because I wear a large, but I like these so much. I went ahead and got these joints in a medium, which may not have been a bad idea because I think the medium might actually fit me okay. Now the material is a little bit different than what I suspected. Straight out the package, it does have a vinegar smell to it, which can be normal for a lot of times when you buy screen tees um, based on the material and how the coloring has been done. So a little string hang off. How the coloring has been done. Um, they may have used vinegar to set the colors in. So I never wear anything before I wash it. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash these and I'm sure that'll knock the vinegar smell out, it usually does. But overall, a very lightweight, breathable material. I can tell you that off top. I'm actually planning to get a pair of Jordan 1s to rock with this. Uh, this and another pair of pants I'll be reviewing shortly. I saw both of these and I was like, yo, these will give me some cool options to go with these pants. But we'll start with the left side of the leg. Left side of the leg, it says, Hustle hard, NYC reason, USA, take what's yours. Love it. I will say the material online looks a lot better. This, this material is not what I expected to be. It's more of that polyester material. I thought it was just gonna be regular sweat pant material, but they still look really good. I think they're gonna be really, really comfortable. So yeah, definitely looking forward to breaking into these. All right, keep it moving. Let's see what else we got in the bag. And I won't do those shits. I'm gonna do this. <laughs> Yo. All right. So next, got just like a a plain t-shirt. Reason got the drippy smiley face on the front. Price tag says twenty nine dollars, but um, I'm pretty sure I pay half of this. So I probably pay about. 14 15 something for this I shop with reason quite a bit because they literally always and I do mean always have a 50% off sale going on always so if a jacket is 60 that means I paid 30 for it so I shop with them quite a bit because they always have good sales um the back of the shirt bam love it love it love it 
So we've got reason up top. Let's see right here. It says start it from the bottom. Love it, love it, love it. Got the two tigers here. You got the R for reason. Let's see what it says right here. We've got, let's see if y'all can see that. Uh, SS21 collection inspired by, who is this? Modern artwork and ode to our youth. Let's see, a nod to the classic take was yours. I don't know what this says, but I like the way it looks. Got some palm trees with like a little cheetah print on it. We got 033 right here with the little shape. Not sure what that means, but overall, I like the way that the designs were combined on this shirt. I think it looks really, really awesome. So yeah, rocking with this shirt because the front is all like super just some um, chill in the back is like bam we got everything going on here i have the um the jordan 14 taxi colorway the gold and yellows more than likely going to be rocking those with this all right let's see what's next Ooh. all right i actually forgot i ordered this i think it was the the last one they had in my size so this is actually a full jogger I'm ordering it in the summer, like we smack dab in July, but yeah, I won't be wearing this till December because I ain't gonna walk around in no hoodie or nothing. But not sure if y'all can really see it. It's very, very slightly acid washed. You can't really tell all that well. Even when I try to get the light, you can see it a little bit, but it probably just looks like a plain black hoodie, but it's not, it's uh, got that distressed acid wash going on. I will say, the acid wash online looks stronger than it is on this, which is kind of disappointing. I expected a stronger acid wash, but I mean, it, it looks okay. It looks okay. I'm still, still gonna rock it. Uh, nothing too exciting on this one. Uh, it says Reason Brand Limited Edition Collection with, let's say with Hustler, uh, with Hustler. So the Hustler brand, like Hustler, like the Hustler adult magazine, they collaborated on this with. Uh, designed in NYC since 2000 and six so i got the it says here i paid 80 so again we know that means i probably paid 40 for it because i don't do full price on anything with reason but they always have promo codes always 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 uh, let's see the tag in the back just regular reason clothing and i really like the way reason does their tags because you don't have to worry about it itching your back when you have the tags that stand out poking you all in back you ain't got to worry about that with them so yeah really really like that but there we go uh the lettering in case you guys can't see the texturing it has that chanel lettering that i talk about how much i hate so much um speaking of chanel lettering i did two sneaker reviews one for the simpsons and i had another one that i did for the Alalia may jordan one if you have not seen those videos just like before check down in the description i'm gonna leave links for those as well but yeah not too much to tell on the hoodie uh nothing on the back just plain black acid wash <sighs> We're done with that and okay so i'll say the acid wash on the pants looks a little bit more pronounced than on the hoodie it's a little bit better but yes yeah, uh black acid wash on the pants they have the, the one pocket on the back. So it's got the same thing right here that matches the hoodie. And then on the right leg of the pants, you've got your Hustler Chanel lettering. So y'all can see the acid wash a little bit more when I get up closer like that. So that's what the hoodie looks like too. It has like the black and white uh, coloring there as well. So yeah, not sure what I'm, I'm going to wear with these. I have, I don't know if it would be too much of a contrast, but I might try it. I have some Airmore Up Tempos that are like white with different colors in them. So I might rock those with this. I'll just have to see if they match well. But more than likely, I'm probably going to end up going with just a plain black sneaker when I wear this. So getting winter ready. And then last but not least, um, I got a pair of denim jeans from Reason. Now I've never purchased denim jeans. From their company so hopefully these look good i'm already a little concerning about the speckling but hopefully the colors are gonna match so i'll start with just the photo up here so you see it's got the speckling we got some red some blue some green little speckles on the back they've got their reason labeling they've got the little 
reason tag right here. It says $69, so that's around 70, so I'll probably pay like uh, 35 for these, I think, with the sale. Okay. All right, these don't look exactly like I thought they would look, but here they go. I ordered a 36. I'm not even sure if I can fit a 36. I didn't want to get anything too, too baggy, but I'll see how they fit off camera. <laughs> but um, it's got some skulls. So the skulls are actually embroidered. Online, they look like they're Chanel, but I'm okay that they're not Chanel because I'm not the biggest fan of Chanel. But um, yeah, these are embroidered. Kind of like a, they got like a, might actually be smells like leather i don't trust that it is but it smells like leather but we've got the cross skulls and this is on the the right leg so going down the right leg got the cross skulls in the green the red the orange yellow then on the other side got a blue skull it's a light blue skull here and then you've got some other colored skulls at the bottom now i'm not sure why they didn't do one of these in green since they already got a blue up top but you know whatever I'll take it. I'll rock with it. Um, I'm really wanting to get the the Jordan Balvin ones to go with these. Is what I'm thinking. And then I'll get a nice little shirt to match them. But uh, size 36. I'll let y'all know what the the fit is like a little bit later. I hope that they fit okay. <laughs> if not, we'll see. It'll it'll just be a weight loss uh, challenge. It'll be inspiration for me to get on in these. But I think that's all I have in this bag. Yep, y'all, that is that is it. That's all. So thank you guys for kicking it with me and tuning in to my third Reason Clothing Unbagging. Again, if you like what you saw, you want to check out the other apparel that they have because they have a plethora of different items to choose from. Their website is ReasonClothing.com, and you can check that out. Again, uh, if you guys haven't already, don't forget, like, share, comment, subscribe, tell a friend and tell a friend if you're already subscribed, but you happen to keep missing my videos, make sure you hit the notification bell because that's going to keep you up to date on when I have new content rolling out. Also, remember, if you guys missed any of those videos I referenced earlier in this review, just check the description. I'll leave all the links down, but that's all I got for you today on this episode of Daily Swag with your girl, Lady Swag. Until next time, y'all be easy, all right?